What does a sexy drag race feel like? Well, to find out, I'm gonna race a Tesla Model S Plaid against a Tesla Model 3 Performance, against a Tesla Model X Plaid, against a Tesla Model Y Performance over the standing quarter mile. Because I'm Matt Watson, and you're watching Car Wow. Buy, sell, car, wow. So, let me tell you about this Tesla Model S Plaid. It has one electric motor on the front axle, two on the rear, and combined you have 1,020 horsepower and 1,420 newton meters of torque. It weighs in at 2.2 tons and it starts from 116,000 pounds. The Tesla Model X Plaid has the same propulsion system. However, it weighs 2.5 tons and costs 127,000 pounds. The Tesla Model 3 Performance has 530 horsepower and 660 newton meters of torque. It weighs 1.9 tons and costs 57,000 pounds. The Tesla Model Y Performance has the same propulsion system as the Model 3 Performance, but it weighs two tons and costs 60,000 pounds. Now, if you'd like to compare all the car stats, just pause your video now. Now, if you like these kind of drag races and you haven't done so already, make sure you subscribe to this channel and hit the bell icon to turn your notifications on. That way you won't miss when I upload the next video that we're filming after this. It's really exciting. You don't want to miss out on that. So subscribe and hit the bell icon. Also, I want to say a huge thank you to Los, L Los, 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 the people who've lent us this car, it's in German, I don't know, they've driven all the way from Stuttgart. Also, I want to thank Next Rental, or Next Rent, or something like that. They bought us the Model X Plaid all the way from Germany. Thank you very much. If you're wondering who lent us the Model Y, it was Tesla's press office. Though it appears they didn't get the memo about us needing a white car. Also, I want to say thank you to the chap who has lent us the Model 3 performance, but he's driving the Model X performance, so I can speak to him directly. It's Richard Simons from RSEV YouTube channel, so. Hi, Rick, how are you? Hello, Matt, all good, how are you? Well, I'm good, because I'm in a Model S Plaid, and we're going to have a drag race and compare the performance of all the quickest versions of each Tesla model lineup over the quarter mile. I've been wanting to make this sexy dream come true for ages. I'm not in your dream, am I? Richard, it appears that you are in my dream. And it's mm. the X-rated dream. <laughs> I feel a bit queasy. Shall we get on with the race? <laughs> moving quickly along. <laughs> and I don't blame him, actually. It was a little bit odd. Now, if you're thinking about buying a Tesla, you can check out all the different Teslas on the CarWow website. Click on the pop-out banner up there or follow the link in the description below. You can buy a Tesla through CarWow. That is correct. Now, if you want to do that at a later date, just simply Google Help Me CarWow and we will help you change your car. You can even sell your current car through CarWow by just uploading some photos of your car giving a brief description, then dealers all across the country will bid on your car, pick the highest offer, they'll come to your house, take the car away, and put the money into your account. It's dead easy. Right, let's finally race. Three, two, one. Oh, it's a terrific launch. <laughs> oh. It's just astonishing. Should not go this quick, a car this size. I mean, that is just absurd. <laughs> just gone. I think I absolutely nailed that. You did. You just got the jump from me in the start. But it's astonishing, isn't it? This kind of keeps a reasonable pace, but you're pulling away for sure. How about you three? Was that all right? Same thing? That was really good. I think I was level with Richard in the Model X for a little while. And, well, I say a little while. I mean a really little while. And Model Y. Yeah, poor old me at the back here. This car is extremely fast by any measure, but the way those things are pulling away is quite something to behold, to be honest. Let's do it again. Oh, Matt's peeling away. As expected, it's between the S and the X. Oh, wow. So that was a um, two races in one, really, wasn't it? 
Oh, is there more to us? Okay. I can't even see them actually at the moment. <laughs> we'll wait for them to make their way up here to join us. So what was your launch like? Uh, I launched so hard it almost feel faint. It must have been even harder for you. <laughs> I've launched quicker, but not many cars quicker. If you want to see exactly what I'm talking about, click on the pop-out banner up there for the link in the description below for the fastest car I've ever launched. Model 3, did you beat the Model Y like you should have done? Certainly did, but uh, feels like a bit of a, <laughs> a hollow beating compared with the two cars you were in. You had a sexy hollow beating. You, uh, you sound surprised. So then, what exactly happened? Well, the Model S won completing the standing quarter mile in 9.8 seconds. The Model X took 10.1 seconds, the Model 3 11.9 seconds, and the Model Y was last. It crossed the line in 12.4 seconds. Now we can have a rolling race from 30 miles an hour over the half mile. I'm gonna call it in. Three, two, one, go. Clinging on with the S. The X is really quite close, but now nah, I'm gapping it. Right, so that was very clear, Richard. X and S were very close like at first, but obviously this is more streamlined, so it just eased ahead. It was closer than I thought it would be, considering this is a bit of a brick. And then I actually hit the limiter at 167. I did the same. Can't you increase the top speed a little bit? If you engage track mode on the Model S, it should increase the top speed to 173 miles per hour, but I don't have track mode in the X. It's the only one here that does not have track mode. I'm in drag strip mode. Do I need to come out of that? No, drag strip mode's fine. As long as you're in track mode, it in theory should go to over 170. There will be an upgrade coming. If you get the carbon brakes, Tesla will then unlock the car to more. <laughs> 60 kilometers an hour or something, but you don't have carbon brakes, so they're not going to do that. Well, I have got track mode on, but it held me about 165 mile an hour. We'll come on to brakes in a moment because can be quite shocking. I think carbons might be a worthwhile upgrade if you're doing a lot of performance stuff in your Tesla Model S. But anyway, let's just do another race first. Okay, we're gonna have another rolling race, this time from 50 miles an hour over the half mile. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> this is pulling so hard. It's closer now though between me and the X. It's not that far behind it. Same story, different day, I think, Richard. It wasn't far behind, really, was it? No, but they've got the same power, right? And once you move in, I suppose the weight thing, the traction thing, less of an issue. I've, yeah, that's all. It's, bleh, 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 bleh. That was insightful. <laughs> this thing's so fast, it's just completely scrambled my brain. I can no longer talk. <laughs> There's not much to say, is that? Anyone? 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 Will anyone say anything? I just heard a, a mess of static on the radio there. What Matt was trying to say is just down to aero, but he just went blah, 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 blah. Elon, can you start building radios? Though I suppose if you promise them for next year, we'll get them in 2043 or something. Okay, now we're going to do a brake test from 100 miles an hour. See how well these cars can stop. When we reach the line, full emergency braking. Whichever car stops in the shortest distance wins. Will any of these cars stop before the end of the runway? We're about to find out because Tesla's brakes aren't that good. Here comes the line. Now, if you'd rather watch another video, click it here quickly. If not, let's brake now. Sort of not what I was expecting, really. I thought the three would do best, then the Y, then the S, and then the X. And X did the worst, S did the best, and I think the Y beat the three. I wonder if we did it again, we get a completely different result. I think I'd be further down the runway if we did it again, but happy to do so. All right, do you know what we should do? Can somebody get a cone and put it level with the X? Okay, everyone, let's see what happens this time. Here we go, here's a line. I actually stopped better. <laughs> so did I. <laughs> How does that work? 
The theory that I had has completely gone to pot. And the interesting thing is that the actual pecking order of how well they stopped remains the same. <laughs> it's just they all did slightly better. Well, there you go. Things don't always work out exactly as you thought they would. <laughs> the drag race did, but the braking didn't. Anyway, if you're thinking about buying a Tesla or any electric car for that matter, check out the CarWow electric car page here. You can compare offers on a wide range of electric cars. Just click up there for the link in the description below. Alternative Alternatively, just Google help me car wow and you can do it that way. Now, I hope you'll enjoy the video. If you did, give it a like. Click on those windows there for some more videos and on that box there to go to car wow to silly car the easy way. You just upload photos, give a brief description, then dealers all across the country will bid on your car. It's easy. Thanks for watching.